this is our accommodation for the next four days. So we are in Milan. It feels so dangerous here. Got our gelato in the shape of a flower. Okay, so we are done like walking around the streets. There were like so many, so many shopping and like sightseeing, but um, now we're gonna have our dinner in Italy. Thank God we can still afford dinner outside. <laughs> Alright, so now we are going to have our first legit meal in Milan. They actually introduced, um, they recommended, sorry, the fish and uh, some pasta. So this is the pasta. So this is our apartment in Italy, Milan. It's quite cool because it's like a <laughs> hobbit hole. <laughs> Ooh, we're back. So you know this reminds me of scenes in like movies where <laughs> they will take Successful proposal. Woo! We have fiancés now. How cool is that? It's the second day in Milan, and we're going through the Hobbit hole again to go out. And it's so cold. And Jeremy. So we just strolled in the park in Milan and now we are going to eat our lunch. So our lunch uh, here because we try to save the time as much as possible because it's kind of like winter and during spring so a lot of shops actually close at like 5pm or 6 or 7 depending on which city you are in. Uh, and that's why we have to try to uh, get the best out of what we can within their opening hours especially if there's a particular thing that we might want to see and that's why we try to save time by eating on the go like having food like um, yogurt or like cheese or like chips for our lunch yeah. So we just got dressed. We were given a locker to keep our stuff and um, a rope. You have to change into a self swimsuit. And we're given towels and slippers as well. Yes. This is included. And we're going to try out the pool. So now 
now we are inside here, we are seated at this particular waiting area and you have to claim your food and drinks within I think half an hour of your uh, arrival time. So we are each given a glass of like champagne. You can choose either the classic one or the rosé one. And they even gave us like ham, fruits, pickles, just like checking out at others whether is it one portion per person or it's like for sharing and then there's I think cheese I suspect this is cheese awesome and I think this is probably my meringue but I'm a people can we bring them home oh what's this potato chips, chips. and then there's like maybe meringue. I suspect this is meringue No, it's bread. Yeah, we can probably put this in the washroom. You know, pro tip to save money. I'm just kidding, but yeah, that's about it. And all together, we paid how much? How much? 104. 104 euros for two pack. this bus it's actually a sauna room I brought, I bought, brought my own conditioner, thank god, but they have their own soaps and all. So now we're living. Ooh, out into the open. Apparently, this is Jeremy's favorite activity from Milan. Now we are at the Afta, so Jeremy found this place. And we are at the second date here. Yeah. Oh, this is the first time we have seen this. Alright. Now we have a... Oh, this is like, I'm trying out this new makeup but seems like it's not really working. It's a bit darker at the side. I'll improve on it. <laughs> okay, so today is our last day at Milan. And we have to claim tax free for items that we have bought. Above 150 euros. Hoping we can stop at Chiasso as we go back to Zurich. To do the tax refund. It's been a hassle and it's quite an amount. Jeremy is worried and we have been carrying our luggages. But we are at Milan uh, Central train station. 